had a, a, a message from Mike on YouTube saying impressed the way that this paper is not cockling did you do anything to stretch it I think the traditional method is to stretch your watercolour paper before you start painting especially if you're using the thinner stuff I think anything sort of less than 140 pound in weight generally needs a bit of a stretch in the heavier much heavier than that I don't think you need to stretch it to be honest I've never used anything that heavier than 140 pound um, tends to be a bit more expensive I try and keep everything fairly cheap seen as a uh, especially like when I'm painting on YouTube I think my philosophy has always been that anybody watching can do the same thing I don't want to be using really expensive materials and people thinking well you know you can only achieve that because he's using the professional quality paper and paints and brushes so when you watch any of these videos and I've got about a thousand of them now on my YouTube channel um, anyone can do the same thing I've been saying that for years I'm not using any particular special techniques or materials or anything so uh, get back to the question um, no I don't I don't pre-stretch it at all um, I just clip it to a piece of plywood that I have leaning against the ears it's just a 9mm bit of plywood that I just cut cut to size just to suit the, the width of the piece of paper that I'm using 15 by 11 um, and then I just wet it and then what I find is after I wet the paper all over, I start on the sky and generally by the time I've finished with the sky, about two or three minutes in, it's stretched um, and then all I've got to do then is just take, take the, a couple of the, the clips over on the, on the one side and just pull it tight and refix it. So basically I'm stretching the paper as I've, as I've started the painting. Um, a lot of people like to do it beforehand. If you do it beforehand, you can, uh, it's, you just got, you just got a, a, a a stretch surface throughout the whole painting, you haven't got to worry about that, it's just, just up to the individual choice really, so I hope I've answered your question, um, keep practicing and I'll see you next time.